Doctors are saying this flu season is the worst it's been in five years. The flu is taking over the South with 12 states being severely affected, one of those states being Texas. KHK's Kara Rucker met with a doctor at UT Health Northeast and brings us the details. UT Health Northeast has been busy treating patients with the flu. Doctors say it took a while this year for it to really take off, but it's in full swing and it's peak time. It has hit later than previous years. We're into March and we're still just now seeing the peak. There's a different strand of the virus that's knocking people down this year. It's called H3N2, and when that strand is dominative, the virus is way worse and symptoms are heightened. Since the particular strain we're dealing with is one of the, the more severe strains, so if you get the flu, you're going to be sicker, but we're also seeing a higher percentage of the, of the population get sick. Dr. Schaefer says it can take a person about four to six weeks to fully recover after coming down with the flu. They call it post viral malaise when your body is really tired and weak after being sick. Even after you clear the infection from the bloodstream and we can't find any evidence of it in your system, you can still feel terrible and just have a very low energy state. The flu is a serious illness as it can lead to pneumonia. The pneumonia is the number one complication of the flu that leads to, to hospitalizations, um, respiratory failure, and even death. Now as Kara Rucker reporting, getting the flu shot will reduce your risk of getting the flu by almost 50%. Now Dr. Schaefer says it's not too late to get one if you haven't already. The Equipment High School Anchor Club delivered